Hey guys, welcome to this notes video. Uh, this is the ultimate set of notes for sequences and series. So I'll explain what's going on here. It's sequence, term, a comma, or a. If you see one of those things, you're gonna deal with the sequence. Now similarly here, if you ever see the word series, sum, a plus, or an S like this, or the sigma notation. Any of these things, if you see them, you want to use the series row. Now the infinite series, basically if you ever see the word infinite series, or if you ever see an infinity symbol anywhere, similarly like this, there's never gonna be an arithmetic for this, it's always geometric, and this is the formula right here. And before you do anything, you always wanna make sure that the absolute value of R is less than one. If it's not, then this formula doesn't work. So there's all the notes, copy them down, memorize them for tests. And here I also defined all the terms. A sub one is the first term, A sub n is the nth term. So A sub five would be the fifth term. D is the common difference. You can calculate that common difference by taking the second term minus the first term or the third term minus the second term, etc. And then the R is the common ratio. That's the second term divided by the first term or the third term divided by the second term, etc. And that's for geometric only. And then S sub N means the sum of the first N terms. That's it. So I hope this all makes sense. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.